to this special multiplayer DVD version of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Your chance to try your luck in that famous hot seat and compete against your family or friends to be the first to reach the magical million pound mark and the chance, of course, to win a family holiday to Universal Mediterranea. Now, all you need is your DVD remote control. You can move around the screen and make your choices by using the up, down, left, right and enter buttons. It really couldn't be simpler. Right, if you're ready, let's play. Right, here we go. Let's go over the rules, although I'm sure you're familiar with them all by now. You are 15 correct answers away from winning a virtual million pounds. Now, as always, you can walk away at any time. And if you do get stuck, then you have the usual three lifelines. There's 50-50. You can phone a friend, or of course you can ask the audience. OK, if you're ready, all you need to do now is select the number of players, and we can play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Right, you have 15 questions and three lifelines. The very best of luck. Let's play. Okay, for 100 quid, here's question number one. Nice one, it's the correct answer. Have a look at question number two. It's worth 200 quid. You're absolutely correct. Well played. Here's question number three. It's worth £300. Well played. That's correct. Remember, a wrong answer here and you will leave with nothing. I'm sure that won't happen. Question number four. Absolutely correct. Well played. Now, get the next question correct and you'll leave with at least a thousand pounds. Good luck. Here comes question number five. Yes, that's the right answer. You've reached the first milestone, that's £1,000. Now, have a look at question six, because it could double your money to 2000 Which 1953 Disney cartoon featured the song The Second Star to the Right? Pinocchio, Cinderella, Peter Pan or Bambi? Well played, that's correct. Here comes question number seven out of a possible 15. It's worth 4,000 pounds. Good luck. Which is a top London model agency? Gale, Hurricane, Storm, Typhoon. That's absolutely correct, well played. Okay, if you choose the right answer to the next question, you can double your money to £8,000. Let's have a look at question 8 of 15. In which century was the English adventurer Sir Walter Raleigh beheaded? 14th, 15th, 16th or 17th? Okay, you've decided to use your 50-50. Computer, please take away two random wrong answers, leave the correct answer, and the one remaining wrong answer. Okay, you've decided to use your phone a friend lifeline. Choose the friend you'd like to call, but remember, you do not have to go along with their answer. Oh yes, D is the correct answer to that. Choose D. I know it's the right answer. Well played, you're absolutely right. 
Right, the jumps are starting to get a lot bigger now. Here is question nine for a possible £16,000. Which gas is responsible for the effect known as will-o'-the-wisp? Ethane, butane, propane or methane? Don't let anyone else put you off. Congratulations, that's the right answer. OK, this is where the drops start to get steeper. Get the next question wrong and you lose £15,000. But get it right and you win 32000 guaranteed. In 2003, Tom Ford announced he was quitting as the creative director of which fashion house? Armani, Versace, Dior or Gucci? Congratulations, that's the right answer. Right, question number 11 is worth £64,000. You would still walk away with 32000 even if you got it wrong. But let's hope you don't. Which US president was born on the 4th of July? Calvin Coolidge, George W. Bush, John F. Kennedy, Theodore Roosevelt. Now there's no changing your mind once it's gone orange. Is that your final answer? That's absolutely correct. Well played. Right, the next question is worth a whopping £125,000. It's number 12 of a possible 15. Take your time, it's a lot of money. When opened in 2003, what was missing from the new £4.5 million Edinburgh Park railway station? Timetables, track, platforms or toilets? Is that your final answer? If it's wrong, you lose £32,000. Of course it is, that's the right answer. Right, now just take your time and relax. The next question is number 13 of a possible 15. If you answer and you're wrong, you drop back to £32,000. Here's the question for a quarter of a million. Used as the title of a 1980s TV drama, what is the meaning of the Japanese word tenko? Camp, curfew, roll call, or prisoner? Are you absolutely sure we're talking about a huge amount of money here? Wonderful, it's the right answer. This is now getting very, very serious. You are just two correct answers away from winning one million pounds. But if you give me a wrong answer here, you will lose £218,000. Not good. Have a look at question number 14, but think very carefully about what you want to do. Where was the actor Richard E. Grant born? South Africa, Zimbabwe, Mozambique or Swaziland? That's the right answer. It's going really well so far.
fantastic. You have played a brilliant game so far, and now you have £500,000. But we would really like to give you one million. Take as long as you need. Here comes the million pound question. Due to the eruption of a volcano, which is the now uninhabitable capital of Montserrat? Plymouth, Portsmouth, Dover, or Southampton? I can't believe how tense this is. Okay, you'd like to ask the audience. Audience, have a look at the possible options. Are you ready? Okay, all vote now. Well, you could have walked away with half a million pounds. Uh, instead, you'll be walking away with one million pounds. That's the right answer. Fantastic. What a tremendous game. All 15 questions answered correctly. Well done. You are a virtual millionaire. Congratulations. Now, for a chance of jetting off for a fabulous holiday to Universal Mediterranean, all you have to do is write this special win code on the postcard provided and send it to us in the post. It couldn't be easier. Good luck. Well done and thank you for playing. Who wants to be a millionaire?